What's up guys? My name is Anton Suarez and in this video I'm going to be showing you how to make a bootable flash drive or USB drive. Once you have at least one that I would say has more than 4 gigabytes of memory on it, I recommend 4 and up. This is 16 so this will be good. Go to the link in the description below, which is Rufus, or Rufus, I don't really, I can't pronounce anything. And this is the program we are going to be using to make this USB drive be able to boot a new operating system on the computer. Most likely you're here because you want to make this USB stick either boot Linux or Windows. For this tutorial, we are going to be doing this for Arch Linux, making this into an Arch Linux bootable USB stick. So we're going to take the USB stick and put it into a USB port on your computer. So once you have Rufus downloaded, we're not going to open it just yet. We're going to navigate to the website of your Linux distribution. For my example, we are going to archlinux.org slash download. So here is the magnet torrent link we're going to be choosing. We will actually choose one from one of the HTTP downloads instead of a torrent. So we'll go down. I am located in the United States, so we'll go down and find the United States right over here and we'll just pick the first once we collect the mirror it's gonna to go to this weird looking page what we're looking for is a file that says dot ISO that is a file you're gonna need that is a bootable ISO file or it's a CD image in a sense it's basically a CD in a file form so that's what we're gonna to need to put on our USB so we're gonna download this and that's going to start the download so once your download is done, if you're using Google Chrome, you can say show in folder or just go to your downloads and find the Arch Linux ISO or wherever you're saving it to. So now that we're in Rufus, what we're going to be looking for is make sure your device is selected to the correct device. This is very important because if you have an external hard drive, it will also come up as a USB device. So make sure you have the device properly selected. For me, it's Arch, Lin Arch USB 16 gigabytes, and I know that it is correct. Uh, MBR partition scheme for BIOS and UEFI, that is fine. So now we're going to select this little icon here, which is click to select an image. And once we select this, it's going to navigate me. It should navigate me to my uh, SSD here and then we can go to downloads and in downloads there's only one ISO image which is the Arch Linux 2015.11.01 dual ISO this is the image we're going to be selecting we're going to open it once that is selected it knows that we're using a ISO image It's going to cr quick format the drive create a bootable disk using this ISO image and it's going to do all the things we need to do to make this boot successfully so we're going to press start and it's going to say this message. We're going to select yes, that's fine. And write in ISO image mode, that is fine as well. It will destroy all data on the device. So make sure you've backed up any data that might be on the USB and we're going to continue. So that just about took two minutes and now the USB is properly formatted to boot Arch Linux. So, so for me inside that USB, it looks like this. So after this, we all should be good to go to boot the USB stick. So that's going to be it for the first part. To make a bootable USB stick, you can plug that into your computer and attempt to boot from it. The, in the next video, I'm going to show you how to configure your BIOS to boot to the USB stick. And if you want to use a USB stick as a Linux Live CD to be able to boot into an actual full-fledged Linux desktop, that's going to be in the next video as well. So as always, my name's Anton Suarez. Please rate, like, and subscribe, and I will see you guys in the next video.